Before we get into today's video, I just want to tell you guys about today's sponsor, which is MilesMadeItFi.com. It's going to be our first link in the description. Go ahead, check it out. You can elevate your beats with MilesMadeItFi.com with the top quality loop and sound kits. Feel your creativity and take your music to the next level with our curated collection. From captivating melodies to punchy drums, we've got ingredients you need for chart top and tracks. Explore MilesMadeItFi.com today. It's going to be our first link in the description. Let's get into the video. Yo, what's going on, guys? Miles back in today. Hope you guys are having a great day. And in today's video, we're going to be breaking down a loop I made in the style of Antida Menace, We Too Hard, and just about anybody coming up from that new Atlanta sound. Without further ado, let's go ahead and hop in the video. As you guys heard in the beginning, MilesMadeItFi.com is going to be the first First link in description and then all the rest of my socials are in the description and comment section below man this loop is pretty hard and I, I can't wait to show you guys here's the preview let's get into it All right, so the first thing I started with was this key from Analog Lab. It's called Combo Breaker, and the banks I used was Max Shooter's uh, bank, and it sounds like this. All right, sorry for the, um, you know, little computer malfunction, but yeah, that's just the first sound I used. I didn't add anything too crazy on there. Um, next thing I added, I layered it um, with a pad, and that sounds like this. I threw some delay on here, then portal. It's this, it's one of the uh, default portal presets for shape pan. Um, and now it sounds like this with all, uh, all the effects on. And this sound is from the same Max Shooter Bank guitar, uh, Distorted Love. Next element, I wanted to add some sort of key. So I went and got another bell um, and it sounds like this. All right, and then that just obviously duplicates uh, itself over. Just added some reverb on it and then now it sounds like this. And I made the decay time super long because I wanted it to sound like very distant and very in the back, if that makes sense. Next thing I added, I went to contact and I went to mallet flux. Then I loaded up um, the mallet, obviously. And then I threw this on here. And I'm gonna show you guys the effects as well. So it's just a simple little pattern, simple little counter melody. Um, but I wasn't really fucking with it, so I was like, you know what, let me turn it to kind of like a layer. I started out with Shaper Box, Multi Sci Fi, then into Portal, Pad Breakup from, um, I'm not sure which bank, but it's called Pad Breakup. Either it's from Mac, a Mac Shooter Bank or it's from uh, a default. Then I went into Reverb and then just a little bit. And the limiter is literally just for gain. Um, I didn't even end up touching it. Then I dropped the EQ a little bit so the lows didn't collide with the main melody too much. That sounds like this now. See how it's like a little layer now? Just adds a little bit of a uh, little bit of flavor, a little bit of sauce. All right, next thing I went into was the bass. And that sounds like this. It's a KBZ one shot. Um, as you can see over here, just follow the root notes of the chords. 
same thing as the base in here no effects on there next thing i added uh was this key from contact alicia's keys and that sounds like this but i added some effects on it and now it sounds like this The first effect I started with was Envelope uh, Phaser from Filter Free. Fruity Delay 2, uh, just to add some little flares into the, dun, dun, the little distant uh, part in the background, which sounds pretty cool. And then that's just going into some reverb, and then obviously it all sounds like this. But I felt like the melody wasn't done yet, so I added a texture. Then I added a string and automated the volume, so it's kind of like it swoops in. Then I added these two, this uh, vocal, I reversed it like a... And then... Just duplicates again, and then th listen to just all of these together, bro. Oh, and then I added this um, clock percussion on the bottom as well. That could literally be a movie score in its own. Combined with the melody, man, it just sounds absolutely amazing. I'm gonna wrap up the video here. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys learned something, even if it was just a preset, or if it was just a sound, or a little bit of MIDI inspiration, please consider subscribing down below. Please hit the like button on this video. It really helps the channel out, really helps the channel grow. Thank you guys so much for the support recently. And like I said in the beginning, man, milesmadeitfi.com is the first link in the description, and my socials are down there as well, man. Y'all have a great day. Thank you all so much for watching. I'll see you on the next one.